Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Don't make assumptions. Learn to ask questions. This is a great card. It is always better to ask questions than to make an assumption. Have the courage to ask questions and to you as clear as you can be. Once you hear the answer to that question, you won't have to make the assumption because you will know the truth. Market-wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials right now trading down 74. NASDAQ's up 41. S&P's down 1.5. Gold contract up uh, $34, trading at 18.10, 40 an ounce. We have silver up 29 cents, $20.18. Platinum's up 39, 8 9.28. Light sweet crude, just the opposite way, man. Pretty wild, and particularly uh, when you get the dollar going down, uh, this is uh, that's that's deviant, man. Uh, oil's down 2.27, 88.39. Notes and bonds, this is just as deviant. Notes and bonds continue to go to higher price. You get the 10 year up 21.6, 120.24. 30 year up 29 at 143.24. And king dollar, king dollar right now is trading. Where are you, man? There you go. Down 777 ticks at 105.729. The euro is at 102. The yen's at 132. And the British pound is trading at 121 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. What do you have? Well, when I just did that update, you know, bottom line, folks, is that when they, when the Dollar's down this much. I mean, I know we've had a you know basically you know a pretty good week here. Um, that being said, man, this dollar you know down this much, this this market shouldn't have had a problem. You know, this spy blowing through this 417. We made it to 415.09. You know, so you know we'll see what happens with the jobs number tomorrow morning. But what we have right now is that you got a sideways market that's trying to get over the June 1st level. That's in the SPY, okay? If we go take a look at the Qs, now the Qs are a different story, man. The Qs, they're taking a break. That being said, though, what's happening with the Qs, they, they're, they're already launched, man. They're, 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 the Qs are looking to go to 330. And right now you're at 324. We made it to 324.52 today. Uh, what we will have, we'll have a slight contraction of volume but the volume still should be pretty good. We should run in about 40, 45 million shares. Gold, gold contract caught the bid out here. We take a look at gold. Bottom line, you're at 1,810. You've done um, 142,000 contracts. Not bad, not great. Uh, it's taken out a B point, but the B point we had 174,000, I think. Let me put this up. It was either 172,000 or 174. Let's see. 174,000 contracts. We're at 142. So what happens there, the bottom line, you don't have a ABC up. But I suspect that this thing is heading now. We're at 1810. Uh, bottom line, it's going to head for the swing point of 1900. That's how this is set up right now. So pretty cool. Notes and bonds. Now look at this, man. This is something else. Okay. So we... Go to the 10 year note first. And the 10 year note right now is back over the B point. There it is. We rejected lower price yesterday. So what we did yesterday is this. Yesterday you got down to the price point of 119.10. You did 1.8 million contracts going into 1.99. Bottom line, the Number to keep your eye on is that, yeah, that 12016, we're back over it again. That's saying 124 is coming at us, man, which is just so deviant, it's unbelievable. At the bottom line, that's how it's set up. And we are at 2.67 inside of the 10 year. Now, let's go into this dollar, because the dollar, you know, this bottom line out here today is that, you know, it's giving it up on price. You know, the benchmark on the dollar is this 106.792. That's the higher range. Um, you know, we'll see how it handles. Uh, it looks to me like it's going to go right back down to this 105. And the kick, this is the kicker here. Let's do this. This dollar has actually broken the whole trend. And, okay, and then it 
it saved itself. That's what it did. But let me do this again. Let me do this a different way. Not a different way. I'll show you because one trend is is broken. The second one, you know, bottom line, the trend the trend that's broken goes from the 101 area. Like that's pretty clear. Is that 101? Yeah, it's 101. 101, 296. Okay, that that one's broken. The harder one is that like that you can actually bring it all the way down, and you're gonna see. We actually, well, we never broke it. It came right to it. That one there it starts back at uh, 95. So that's really intriguing, man, because if, you know, if we get another wide price spread down day in the dollar, bottom line, that's how that would be set up, that you would bust that, uh, bust that out. That's the, that's the bottom line. Let's go take a look at some of the higher volume equities out here. And... Um, so you get advanced micro up six and a half dollars, six dollars. Coinbase is up eight dollars. You get uh, Black Stone or Black Rock, one more, one, Black Rock. Uh, they're gonna start doing some business in that, on that platform with them. So that's pretty wild. Uh, you get Nvidia up uh, three fifty. Um, Occidental's off two fifty. Oh, let's go over that oil market, man. CL. Let me see this thing. So active oil contract. Okay, so we take a look at this. You get 308,000 contracts. You're breaking the swing. You get volume on the break, man. This is an ABC down. This is going to get interesting, man. Uh, let's watch this shake out, man. Okay, so you almost got 111 to 88, you get uh, 23, would get you somewhere down around 78. Yeah, this thing is game, man. This is game is down, uh, yeah, that's, that's, gonna, that's gonna take some heat off the, uh, um, you know, the fuel. There's, there's no doubt about that, man. I mean, that's how, that's how it's set up. Uh, what's so intriguing here, is that you get a double banger. What I mean by that is this, is that when you have oil, uh, the dollar coming down, oil should be, should go, should be going up. No. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back with our man, Mr. Basil Chapman. We have the Dow Industrials right now down 40. NASDAQ's up 58. S&Ps are up three. We're coming right back.